Me and the bearded explorer attempted to venture into this magnificent mansion built 148 years ago. And just when there seemed to be no way in, the owner showed up. He invited us in to take a look around before the mansion is demolished and lost forever. in 19th century mansion. Take a look at this. Um, but the key definitely went into it. But didn't turn. But didn't turn. No, that's, no. that's broken. I think they've tried yeah, kicking that door in. Well, that, that's, that, that, that's not the problem. That's not actually... There's not a key in there. That's snapped off, is it? Well, yeah. Oh. Well, that's it. It's stiff. Wow. Uh, huh. I'm very happy for you to, before we do that, for you to go in and do some stuff. Amazing, thank you. What a beautiful mansion. I mean, apparently there's quite a lot of stuff left down in the basement. Wow. Chandeliers in every single room. There's like an old clock out here on the wall. Not even sure if I can see it from here. There it is. Oh no, talking to some guys that are sealing up the building as we're inside. Built as a residence for somebody very wealthy and then turned into a care home, but it's actually been closed for around 10 to 15 years. So let's go through these corridors. I do not know what to expect. I did see some rooms with like wooden paneling. Look at the door handles as well. Door handles of the rich and famous. Apparently some people broke into the building last night so they're actually gonna seal this place up completely. I wonder if these are original fittings from the 19th century. Look at the staircase. Can actually see some stained glass window here. Look at this, how grand. That's incredible. Check this stained glass window out. If you check in this wood panel in the secret doors all over the shape. Some amazing fireplaces. So today me and Ben are filming this one. This section is amazing. And you can even see out the back garden how big the grounds were. 
And there's some derelict barns and proper made out of Victorian bricks all at the back. So apparently there's a chapel that the guy that owns this will not go to the top because the stairs are so dangerous. But you know what we do. So let's get up the stairs. Oh my word, the stairs, spiral stairs. But look how small they are. Spiral staircase, which apparently takes us to a chapel. This is incredible. Oh, man. Whoa, they are very small stairs. Yeah, and they're getting a little bit. Ooh, there's a cable there. You have to be careful of the cable, Ben. It's a rope, I think. Wow. Maybe to a bell. Oh, my word. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, wow, yeah. Yeah, they're actually starting to separate. What, the stairs are yeah, separate? Yeah, they're on the roof. This takes you onto the roof. No way. These stairs are crazy. Oh my God, look at this rope. You kind of need them to go up this. Be careful up there, man. I know, I know. Oh my God. That is amazing. Literally amazing. sketchy these stairs are. These old chapel stairs. I wonder how long this rope's been here. Don't know. Years. Nothing stable up here anymore. We've got to go back down the dangerous staircase. Aye. Our 21st century bodies are not made for this type of building. Oh, there is a door here. Oh, is there? Looks screwed shut, but he did say we could uh, unscrew he did, them. He did, yeah. Yeah, that's dangerous. Up another flight of steps, and there seems to be a third one. I'm wondering if we can get to the chapel up here, or we're gonna have to ask the guys to unscrew the door to the chapel. Not sure how long it's been sealed for. For the door handle to be in the center of the door, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's room 13, mate. Oh. Oh, no. There's still quite a bit of stuff in there. Mm. That chair's nice, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Like that. Yeah, the chair's lovely, oh, even. The balcony. Even this piece of woodwork is probably really old. There's even, even some stained glass up in these windows. Wow. Huge rooms with high ceilings. <laughs> yeah, old cars, that's crazy. Oh, we've got a BMW Z3. That's the M hatchback one. That's quite a good car. That's not real, sadly. Yeah, you find that out of the car. Yeah, that's quite a good Nice. Huh. And what's that? Is that an Land Rover? Yeah, I think it is, yeah. Yeah, some of the stained glass in here. It's probably original as well. Yeah. Going into another room, which eventually was a care home, but closed around 10 years ago. But look at these stone windows. 
What a shame, this place actually might get demolished. People's stuff are still left inside these cupboards. Look at these gloves. The building doesn't actually look in that much disrepair from the outside. So it will be a shame if they're gonna demolish it, I guess, but the amount of land it comes with and the property development. There's still some artwork left on these walls here. Seems as though some of the artwork's been left behind. I'm not sure how old this stuff is up to the third floor. The bearded Explorer is up here. So we're on the third floor. Room after room. Is it just a loft space or can we get to the chapel? I don't know. Look at this room with the wood panelling. We're on the third floor. So we're right up now and you can even see the stairs leading up to the mansion. And like the old greenhouses, Victorian greenhouses. Uh. This is a strange room going in here. Look at the skylight. How weird's that? In a, somebody's room. That has to be one of the creepiest door sounds I've ever heard. Yeah, it looks like somebody's been staying in this room. It is on the top floor, it would have been the safest place. There's actually a kid's scooter over there. Look at this. And then a guitar from a computer game. What a huge mansion. Actually it feels bigger now we're inside. This is quite a big room. Kitchen space on the third floor. There's still some onions left up here. Someone was staying up here then, probably. Oh. Oh my God, bro. Why is that open? Why is that open? Oh my days. Bro, how dangerous is this? I mean, we do need to get down there. Oh my God. <laughs> that is actually terrifying. On the other thing though, look at all the wallpaper on the wall, Ben. Oh yeah. I wonder how old that is. That must be ancient. Mm. 
They look both sides as well. Whoa. Wow, man. No way. Yeah, literally. Yeah, it goes this way. Wow, look how small the foundations are. You've got the arched brickwork there as well. And that's probably only around four foot. This is so cool. How far does it go? Let's take a look at this lift. Wow. I mean, look, I'm at the bottom of the lift shaft. If that lift came down now, I'd be in big trouble. The lift is right up the top there. Down under the cellar. It's like a maze under here. Look at this old brickwork as well. Whoa, there seems to be a secret tunnel. Someone smashed through the wall here. That actually carries on, bro. Someone smashed through the wall, there's like a secret tunnel. What? An actual secret tunnel, man. Going in. Come on, let's kind of look. Wow, it carries on. Oh God, this is really, really old. This is actually crazy. The hell's in there? Where does it go? It does go round the corner. Oh, it's low. Do you think that's another room? Don't know. Oh mate, it's another room. What the hell? It's opened up into another room. This is madness. A secret tunnel that leads to huge spaces. What are we gonna find oh, down there? This is actually crazy. What the hell? Oh, there's a boiler in there though. Right. We're deep in like the bowels of the building. Way. There's another door over there which goes somewhere. What's in here? Oh, Whoa! That's a massive safe. Oh my days. Look at it. Oh, it's locked. It's locked. Ah, oh, what a shame. That is absolutely stunning. Wow. Look at this safe. It's absolutely incredible. Yeah, that lock is very different. You can see the type of key that we need to look out for. Mm. Going into the last little office space. Oh my God, there's some keys. Bro, there's some keys. Huh? Found some keys. Keys? Yeah. Potentially safe keys. Really? Yeah. Look. <gasps> Should we go and try it? We have to try it. Oh my god, this could actually be the key for the safe. It could be. I don't even think Nick knows the layer in there, so let's kind of see. Is this the key to go actually fit the whole safe? Is there anything interesting in there? I am super excited for this to find out if one of these keys actually fits that safe. Ah, oh, this is it, mate. Right? The truth. Alright, let's get all the keys out here. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be that one because that's a safe box key. So yeah, I try this one first. No, it doesn't even go in there. Try that one. Come on, it's close. Let's get the safe open. Get this one. No, that's one left, and it's a brass key. Yeah. <gasps> Mate, that's slotted right. It's clicked. Hang on. No way! Oh my! Oh, it's wait. worked! It's worked! It's worked! Okay. Oh my God! What is in the safe? What is this in the safe? This hasn't been opened in years, man. This bag oh in there. God, there's actually stuff in there. There's a key as well, Ben. Look at that. No way! Oh my God! How old is that key? I wonder what that's for. What the hell? Maybe that leads to the chapel. That is. Opens a, the chapel maybe. door. That is a very, very old key. Look at it. Look at the safe it was in as well. I know. Is that 
S3. It's got S3 written on it. I don't know what that means. That is seriously old. Wow, we need to find out what that key fit is. We're going to have to let Nick know that we found that. Yeah, true. But what we'll do, we'll put it back in there and keep it safe in there for now. We'll leave the key in the safe. So that's the end of the explore. Thank you to the members of the channel and the subscribers of the channel. Make sure you like the video and share the video. This place is absolutely amazing. Let's hope it survives and we'll catch you in the next one.